A scarecrow is basically a mannequin dressed in old clothes in the shape of human, used to scare off birds like crows or sparrows from crops. You won't believe, but in the southern Appalachians, people used to use dead crows, who were hung upside down from a pole to scare off birds. A series of tests conducted in 1980 found that small ponds near scarecrows saw a 95% drop in visits by local ducks. Those are water scarecrows, okay? But when we say scarecrow, we usually think about those dummies who are placed on cornfields, right? So the main question is, do scarecrows actually work? The answer is yes and no. The traditional scarecrows do work against crows and blackbirds, but that's only temporary, okay? Over time, birds get used to those standing in one place dummies and they get a little suspicious about those dolls. And then they start to demolish those crops again and again. Another series of tests with mannequins protecting a simulated soybean field from doves found that each scarecrow could protect between 0.03 to 0.06 acres. With that numbers, you would need 16 scarecrows per acre or more than 10,000 per square mile. But with all those scarecrows, the birds would always get used to all of them hanging around in the fields. So if you want to outsmart those little flying demolition squad, just move your scarecrow once every few days. But more high-tech option is a robotic substitution called AgriLaser, who randomly deploys laser beams and the results are pretty good. It's a very quiet system and the birds didn't find a plan to outsmart lasers. Yet. Thank you for watching my video. Subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for more interesting content. Goodbye.